Let's talk about recovery from lower eyelid procedures like a blepharoplasty. Upper eyelid procedures are relatively light in terms of swelling and bruising. Lower eyelid procedures are a little bit more invasive, so the swelling and the bruising tends to be a little bit more significant. At about day two or three, you can expect your eyes often to be almost completely swollen shut. There can also be some swelling that kind of creates a little bit of a cat eye appearance, which again should resolve pretty quickly, often has gone by one week. In the first week after the surgery, you're going to get antibiotics, you're going to get steroids to help control swelling. You're also going to get some ointments for your eye. It's very important for lower eyelid procedures, especially to give a lot of lubrication to the eye because you can get something called chemosis, which is a swelling of this pink material or the conjunctiva inside the eye. That chemosis can pull, push the lid away and actually kind of make it look like the skin is kind of pulled down a little bit. We need to control that and the way to control it is with lubrication and hydration. So we give you those drops. At one week, patients typically come back. There may be a couple stitches on the corner that are permanent and we remove them. Uh, that's pretty much the only thing. Most of the bruising is typically on its way out. There's still some residual swelling. I would expect swelling and bruising to be gone probably closer to about 10 days. And by two weeks, you should definitely be restaurant ready. When you do lower lid procedures where you have to tighten the muscle, there can be some bunching in the corner here and that sometimes does cause some irregularity to the incision line. Um, that's not uncommon. It usually resolves at about two to three months. Sometimes we give some steroid shots to help that along. The patients can also do massage of that area after about a month if that happens to be a problem. Uh, Long-term recovery from lower lid procedures usually will evaluate the outcome of the procedure at about six to 12 months depending on the type of procedure that was done um, before we call it a final result.